Welcome to MCR Labs. Today we're going to talk about decarboxylation. So Scott has in front of him a big molecule and this is THCA. And we know that THCA is produced by the cannabis plant. But if we were to take a bud from the cannabis plant and eat it, we would not get high. But if we were to smoke it, we would get high. Can you tell us why? Absolutely. So the plant produces the THCA molecule like Yasha mentioned. <clears throat> and then when you add heat to it, either by cooking or by smoking, what you do is you break the bond between these two carbon atoms, and this molecule leaves as a leaving group, and it turns into carbon dioxide, and the hydrogen returns to the molecule, and you get delta-9 THC. This is the molecule that's responsible for the getting high feeling that most people are familiar with. Other ways to decarboxylate this are to heat it up in the oven or to boil it in the oil or butter that you're uh, infusing it with. Um, but the important thing is if you're looking for the effects of THC, that you put enough energy into it to break this bond and remove the CO2 molecule so that you're left with THC. What about the original molecule that we had, the THCA? Does that have any medical effects? There may be medical benefits to using THCA, but the getting high effect comes from delta-9 THC. They're different molecules. It's like a, a, a lock and a key. Inside your body are receptors that represent the lock, and these molecules represent the key. And if you change them just a little bit, it doesn't work. If you click on the link that's in this video, you'll be taken to a video that explains it quite a bit more. Thank you, Scott. If you guys have any more questions on decarboxylation or uh, the science of cannabis, or if you would like to see more demonstrations of what happens to the molecules uh, that are within cannabis, please let us know right below or message us at mcrlabs.com. This molecule is a perfect lock key. Uh, <laughs> can we do it again? So I have some questions for you, Squat. I messed that up again. Can do it again. <coughs> All right, ask the question again. Yeah. Decarboxylation means the removal of a carboxylic acid group from the molecule. D means to D, remove. I don't know how to say this, guys. Why don't you write it down and I'll just say it. How's that? Did it doesn't know. matter what the words are. Just write it there and I'll just repeat it. And I'll just go, decarboxylation means D, removal, carbonation. Yasha. I think we should redo this one more time. <laughs>